Well, this morning, Chuck's Big Adventure is taking us back to the Middle Ages with a modern twist. Here in Indiana, can you believe mm -hmm. it? Now, if I told you that you could stay at a castle right here in Indiana, you'd probably look at me a little strange like you usually do, right? Yeah, it's kind of unexpected. <laughs> it, 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 it sounds like they really planned out every detail to this as well. They really do. And I've got to say I loved it all, especially the gourmet breakfast made from scratch each morning by Lord Douglas. Even the call to breakfast is medieval. Well, Clayshire Castle is the dream of Doug and Mary Jo Smock. Now, mostly retired, the couple is enjoying their golden years by sharing their dream with others. The 10,000 square foot castle features an impressive great hall, five uniquely decorated guest rooms, and 120 acres to enjoy. And as you might imagine, the castle is a very popular place to get married. There's even a, a, a Renaissance fair, but marriage, like the one that uh, Samantha and Bradley Garbazio had there, well, they tied the knot during the medieval Viking fantasy theme ceremony at Clasher. <laughs> Samantha told me they wanted to put it all together in one wedding and had a great time doing it. And they're not alone. The castle hosts lots of themed weddings each year. We've had Monty Python on the Holy Grail themed weddings. Uh, we've had a bunch of Hogwarts themed weddings. We've had Princess Bride, where I actually did the service for it. Uh, I was the minister. Why we've, don't you say what you said about Marriage. Marriage is what brings us together today. <laughs> <laughs> So I had to do that for the ceremony. Uh, we've had fairy tale weddings, a whole bunch of things like that, and they're just fun. Well, the medieval fair they host each year has vendors, performances, and even jousting. Kid you not. This year it'll be September 24th and 25th, and I have much more information in my blog. It's a wonderful and fun place for the whole family for sure. So it does look amazing, but uh, how did they come up with the name? Well, because it's it, kind of unrelated, right? So <laughs> it's Clay for Clay County, which yeah. is where oh, Bowling okay. Green is, yeah. right? And Shire from the Middle Age word for a little town or area. And it's really a great place for families to get away, relax, and reconnect. And we're going to have much more on Clayshire Castle coming up in it's just really a few fun. minutes. Yeah. It is. It's in Indiana, yeah. which is strange. It seems like it would be a great place to see the kids, too, if they're kind of into the whole Harry Potter thing. You know. As long as they're supervised. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of valuable stuff inside yeah. that castle. That's yeah. what I mean. My family and I, we would go to the Renaissance Fair yes. in Georgia, and none of us had necessarily an interest in any of the medieval world, but it was just always something fun to do. So. Mm -hmm. And when you're there, you dress in costumes, yeah, so I can't wait to show you more. <laughs>